I saw a lot of change in myself from when I was 2 years ago. I improved in a lot of fields such as focus, commitment, discipline and punctuality. Hi friends, I am Ritvik Permala studying in Akash Hyderabad and have joined the 2 years integrated program for JEE Mains and Advanced. I joined it because a friend of mine recommended it to me. After doing extensive research, I have found out that it is one of the best coaching institutions on the national platform and has been producing consistent results in JEE Mains and Advanced for the past few years. Ever since I was young, I was fascinated with math and like tough questions. When I heard that JEE was one of the toughest exams held nationwide, I decided to take it up as a challenge. This inspired me to pursue computer science from IIT Bombay and I made it my primary very cool my father who himself was a software engineer was also a great inspiration to me i solved every question of the materials that akash had provided me like target e caps success magnet and success achiever and whenever i didn't get a question i made sure to revise my concept and even if i still didn't get it then i would ask my teachers i attempted every single test and after i had completed the test i analyzed my mistakes so that those mistakes would never be repeated by me the one on one interactions with my teachers really helped me a lot and boosted my confidence and performance in the exams whenever i did not perform up to the expected mark i would get demotivated and depressed but whenever this happened my teachers and my parents would help me get back up by motivating me i would always revise the same concepts again and again and i would make sure to not repeat the same mistakes and do all the questions accurately so that silly mistakes will not happen whenever i had any doubt they would explain it from the very basics without any hesitating or without showing any kind of irritation they built time for one on one interaction with me so that i would master every topic in physics i initially had troubles with rolling motion but sir taught every single question from the very basics and helped me master the concept in chemistry uh, thermodynamics and equilibrium is a very tough chapters but sir helped me to solve uh, those chapters by sequentially by doing level 1 level 2 and level 3 questions in maths sir always taught me an easy method to solve very tough questions and up- help me approach them in the last month i had continuously written tests one after the other as it was a part of the fts plan the, uh, these tests helped me boost my scores by a lot initially i was not getting very good scores but test after test after analyzing my errors and not repeating my mistakes my scores improved by a lot the immediate uh, paper discussions after the exam proved very fruitful as i was able to immediately de- by my mistakes in inorganic chemistry was proven to be very tough as we keep forgetting it multiple revisions will only help it and we have to keep practicing our speed through qu- solving questions in maths and physics discipline in attending all the classes in solving questions properly helps you in maintaining consistency throughout your journey and also if chance you get low, low marks dis- your discipline will ensure that you uh, keep working and it motivates you to work harder instead of giving up on your journey midway So discipline is absolutely essential and make sure to and you must make sure to maintain it throughout your two years journey. I made short term goals on the number of questions to be completed every day so that I would not lose track and be disciplined throughout my two year journey. Since I am studying for JEE, physics, maths and chemistry didn't prove too tough, but languages were proven to be a bit tough. So I spent the a bit more effort and bit more time on them right from the day one so that I wouldn't face any difficulties in the last stretch. So this is how I balance my JEE and my boards. My journey was not completely stress free. I too faced stress at times, but whenever I felt stress, I made sure it did not get to my head and took a break from studies. I asked guidance from my parents and teachers and they always spent time with me. This helped me to cool down and also get back to my studies very energetically and efficiently. I mainly followed through the Akash material as they carried a wide variety of questions related to each concept. We were given targets which covered the concept as well as the questions related to them and also the previous year questions of JE mains and advanced. We were also given separate modules which contained questions related to JE mains and JE advanced and they carried a wide variety of questions and a large number of questions as well. E caps were assignments that were given to us to be done on a daily on a daily basis so that our concepts will be improved on a step by step basis the final test series that was held in the last few months proved to be very fruitful as the part test helped me understand in which chapters i was weak in and made me understand which chapters i needed to i needed to revise again the mock test helped me to understand on how to tackle the test that contained the whole syllabus which is, which actually happens in the jee mains all the final test series exams were held in computer based mode which is a real simulation of the jee mains so this helped me adapt very quickly to the actual exam and i did not face any real problems due to this my exam was gone, uh, was completed very smoothly and i was able to perform well i enjoyed my journey at akash very much i saw a lot of change in myself from when i was 2 years ago i improved in a lot of fields such as focus commitment discipline and punctuality it also improved my thinking ability and mental ability by leaps and bounds as i solved a lot of tough questions the 2 year je journey will not be completely stress free in lo- at lot of times you'll see ups and downs and you'll feel demotivated at times but you should not give up until the very end you should persevere uh, and consistently consistently put in the hard work so that it will finally bear fruits in the end